Hey guys, so for today's video, we are doing something a little different than what I usually do. We're in a new location of my house. And by new location, I mean my basement. Behind me, there is a bunch of trash. <laughs> I don't like that at all, not one bit. But this pile of trash actually at one point was something desirable. It was an art studio for children. Usually in my videos, I film in various locations throughout my house, usually my sister's room, sometimes my apartment. And I always say in those videos that I have nowhere for myself. I have no place for myself in this house. That might have been a lie. Kinda. I do have somewhere to go actually, it's just a wreck. This was an art studio at one point, this thing behind me. My mom had created this for my sister and I and my brothers when we were little. And as children do, we destroyed it with all of our stuff. This really is like the perfect place for me to film art videos. I don't know what I was thinking. It's just because no one goes in our basement because it's a wreck. So I'm going to be moving into this area and this is going to be my new filming location. So what I'm going to be doing this video is taking all the stuff out, salvaging any good art supplies, throwing anything that's garbage away, organizing all of my art supplies and reorganizing this whole thing and making it look all nice. And then I'm going to move in here and this is going to be my new YouTube filming studio setup. So I'll be in this location probably from now on. Let's get started on the first step. The worst part is going through all of this stuff and throwing out anything uh, that I don't like. The hardest part about that is I am sentimentally attached to almost every object in my house. I just, I find an object and I'm like, oh, I love this object. I, I don't want to throw it away. <laughs> it's been with me my whole life. Why would I throw this object away? But I need to. So we're going to go through and throw away the objects that we don't need. Um, so let's commence phase one, cleaning. So I'm just going to give you a quick sweep of what we have in this basement. Because if you remember from my Bob Ross video, I do have right over here, the mural, the Bob Ross mural, that's right here. So that would be a perfect, it's actually perfect because this is my studio. Right over here on this wall, we have my Bob Ross mural. It's gonna be great. Okay, so over here we have the Bob Ross mural that I painted a while ago. And then we have this mess. Look at this. This is just so much junk. Most of it is just not even art supplies. Ugh. Oh my god. It's just so many things. This is just... That's all I have to say about that. That's a mess. All right, let's get to cleaning. Uh, we have to injure ourselves a couple of times while we're doing this, of course, because I am the most uncoordinated person on the face of the earth. Injury number one. That one, I don't know why I did that. That looked just so dumb. Uh, here I'm just starting to clean the things that are in front of the studio because a lot of that stuff is really not even art supplies and I'm trying to just put it in the correct place. Hurt myself again. That's injury number two. Um, so yeah, just moving that out. A lot of musical equipment, you'll notice. My brothers are in a band, so just lots of musical stuff. Here comes injury number three. This one hurt. Mm-hmm. Yep. And I'm just moving everything out. And this honestly took me a whole day to move just the stuff that was in front of the art studio out of the way. Um, and I think we have injury number four coming up right now. I decided to move weights. They were very heavy. And I may have hurt my back while I did it. And then I took a break because I hurt my These back. That's the truth of the story. Oh, Ugh. here it is. Yep. That is heavier than it looks, those like heavy poles. And there is also a pile of weights. Ooh, I'm holding my back, holding my back. I hurt myself there, yep. Very dusty, very dusty. For someone with allergies, this is a big no. I have very bad allergies and if I don't take these, um, it's not a fun time. I'm not doing well. All right, ladies and gentlemen, get ready for day two. On this miraculous day, I decided to introduce random Morning. items. I don't know why I did Morning. it. I didn't give this one a name. That's watercolor paints. Balloons. Balls of tissue paper. Way too excited about this one. Way too excited. And now I found the beads. Oh, the magnet beads. One. Two. More beads. Three. So this is brand new. Four. <laughs> More beading kits. So here's the thing, I love beads. I have a lot of beads, like hundreds of beads, and I was getting lost in the beads. Lost in the beads. <laughs> Instead of lost in the weeds, get it? <gasps> Glitter. A box. Maybe it's for beads. 
This is my pile of things that I'm keeping, which is basically everything that I've looked at. So we're getting there. We're just gonna, we're looking. We're just looking right now. So at this point, I just decided to take everything out and put it on the ground in piles. Will I need a dowel? No, you don't need the dowel. Put it down. I'm not sure. What if I find another pile of dowels? Sadly, you do find more dowels and you do make a pile and keep them. Ah uh, yes, some hay. Glitter, sticks, all dried up. You hate to see it, you really do. This goes in the trash. Oil pastel colors. Ooh, nice. I don't like these. It's like furry, which I'm not liking. I don't like this one bit. This is a miracle. Hot glue, my best friend. I needed more and I didn't want to order anymore and now I have it. I am lame, hear me yes. roar. This is, this is a great day. <laughs> Uncoordinated. <laughs> are so cute. Tissue paper is just the best, you know? This might be garbage. We might have found it. This is garbage. This is garbage. Trash. Trash. This is not trash. Alina recreated the scream when she was little. She's screaming. So this will definitely be something I keep. And we kept going. I found some unexpected things. Oh, those party poppers. Ready? I'll do it. and found out that they are flammable. They smell like smoke. And I also found some things that I just had no idea what they were. No idea. I'm genuinely, genuinely confused what this is. I don't know what these are. What are these called? What are they called? This I definitely don't need. I don't know what this is. My sister came to look at the stuff. Oh yeah, that's what I was gonna ask if you wanted the <laughs> Benderoos. <laughs> Benderoos, dude. Oh, yeah. they still work. You can't throw our blow pens out. Oh, that's like a knife to the heart. I know, that was the saddest thing I had to throw away, the blow pens. Using like your them. own spit I like to them create art. I like almost as much as, um, I don't know what it's called. You know that thing that used to spin and we used to just like yeah, spin right it? And then, right there it is. <laughs> Would you look at that? <laughs> a spider terrorized me. Oh my god! What, spider? Big spider? Huge, huge, like this big. Dad, I think that's time for me to leave, <laughs> so I'll be, uh, no, I'll be upstairs. No. On to the cubbies. It was at the cubbies that I discovered a pile of feathers, and they went up my nose. Oh, I'm gonna get feathers up my nose. <laughs> the amount of feathers that were just in that. <coughs> it's like I'm telling you, I think they went in my lungs. I breathed in a significant amount of feathers. And we're moving on to the left side of the art studio. And near that spider, it's huge. I don't want to go near it. I may not have wanted to go near that giant spider. It was literally the size of a quarter, but I did it. I did it for YouTube. I did it for you too. For you guys. I did it for you. I was afraid of it all the while. Um, but I managed to clean out all of the art from those cubbies with the spider still on the ground, and I later had even the bravery to pick it up. I am highly allergic to dust, and this is like <clears throat> making my allergies act up and really hurting my throat. For some context on what I'm doing here, these are Hello Kitty nails. There was a Hello Kitty makeup kit that I really liked as a kid, and I was really sad to throw it away, but I had to because everything oh. expired. This one hurts the most. This one really hurts the most. I'm sad. I'm really sad right now. Right in the heart. Last group of nostalgic things. Let's go. A Hello Kitty rug I never finished. No, I never finished it. Wow. This I will complete. A paint by number kit oh, I never wow. finished. Okay. This is a keeper. I mean, why not? Who doesn't like paint by number? Tiny babies. <laughs> These had little batteries and they would like move and like talk to each other when you like put them next to each other. And we just loved these little. They're adorable. They're so tiny. Light brights. Um, I think you know what I'm gonna say. What do you think this has in it? Why am I acting like I'm on Dora? Beads. Yep, more beads. Okay, now on to the actual cleaning with Fantastic, and I found a sticker. There is a giant sticker right here, ow, stuck on this. Every time a child peels a sticker and places it on an item, a mother cries. That was dramatic. That's all I have to say about that. This has ruined the table. <sighs> Look at that! That's just from the table and the shelves! Ew! More cleaning, because we need to. 
The amount of glitter I have on my hands right now is really questionable. I don't know where that came from. Okay, I'm gonna change into painting clothes and then we attack the spider. Oh god, he's touching it. Get away from me! Ah! Get away from I'm me! I'm so scared! Ah! I'm so scared! I'm so scared! Oh! Name a more dramatic person than me. I will wait. Okay. Oh, my neck is like tensing up because I just like tensed so much. Wow, I can't believe I did it! I'm a strong girl. You went across the pond? I went across the pond. <laughs> over the woods. That is not correct. Throw this out. Oh, oh wow. I have been having really good aim. Remember I have caught things randomly? to the exact right location all night. Location, location, I'm gonna, location. I'm just gonna cut to that really quickly. Me throwing things in the exact right spot. Go. I am not doing that, but I am ending the video here. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't, and I will see you guys next video. In the next video, it will be part two. It will be called The Renovation, and I will be redoing the countertops, painting things, putting some wallpaper up, and I'm gonna move in fully and show you the whole result. See you there.